Gcam video and I am going to review some MG Cam today and which is uh, really supporting in Android 13 so let's get it started and let me show you I am using here the Pixel Experience Android 13 ROM here and my device is Redmi 7 but you guys can install this Gcam to any Android devices if you have Android 11, Android 12, 12.1 whatever you have and here is the Android version 13 and this Gcam is perfectly working on Android 13 but if you are facing some problem like freezing or something just watch the video and everything will be fixed and I will of course show you some samples so this is the user interface of that Xiaomi Gcam and before we start let me show you the camera version so here is the camera version you guys can see 8.4.0 Zero, 00 and if you want to use any kind of config file of course you guys can use that one no problem like this one and I have here the pixel tone uh, from pixel 6 and this one is working but I have problem with the front camera in Redmi 7 but if you have no problem on your device you guys can use uh, without any problem no issues and if you don't want to use that uh, kind of pixel tone or any kind of config file uh, try yourself which you want perfect for you and I recommend for Redmi 7 user don't use any config file because it's perfectly working without anything and if you face a freezing issue like this just uh, change your camera module that means the camera modes and everything will be fine without any issue you guys can easily use so that's it if you want to take picture just click like this after opening the camera for the first time just go to setting and go to more setting and you guys can check according to your choice like uh, here we have the camera sounds if you don't need just turn that off and google lens suggestion and other things here we have advanced options just enable show dirty lens warning and hdr control if hdr control plus is not enabled by default just enable that from advanced option and if you need the raw plus jpeg control then enable that feature as well then we have here the camera to api setting if that uh, gcam is crashing on your device then download one application from your play store uh, type camera to api probe uh, the application name camera to api probe after downloading that camera to api probe just open the application and you guys will get the camera to api settings that means your hardware level which is your hardware level just your main lens if hardware level is full and hardware level is 3 just select hardware level full or 3 if you have the hardware level full then select full and if you have level 3 then select level 3 then your uh, camera crash crashing problem will be solved and if it worked uh, then automatically then use in auto mode no issues and other things uh, like upscaling photos and other things will work on other devices and additional settings if you want to add any uh, kind of config file then of course you guys can do that just scroll down and go to config setting then here you guys can save your config file and get back to your file manager then you will uh, be able to see one folder which is called sgcam then just paste your config file on that folder and then double tap here you will be able to uh, select your config file and now what's working everything is working fine portrait and night side and other things and let me capture one photo this one with astrophotography so you guys uh, listen one music and which is really really cool so and this gcam is perfect for redmi 7 for right now because uh, and the charging uh, because uh, it doesn't take much time to uh, compress or complete the process of sdr plus or enhance or other things so that's why it's really really cool it doesn't take time and in video section we have 
are some extra things like if you want to select microphone and external microphone and bluetooth everything is uh, available here and if you want to select 4k and fsd 30 24 fps and auto and 60 everything is working according to your choice you guys can select and we have here slow motion and time lapse and slow motion is uh, a bit working i guess let me show you So that's it and then let me just get back and that's the night side or night mode camera which I already taken the photo and this is the slow motion you guys can see it's perfectly working here and now let me show you some samples I have taken using uh, this camera and which is really really cool I only just focus here that one and every single details is available in that picture now let me show you the another one and here is the red color and orange color and white color and other things uh, which is accurate which exactly I have seen in my eyes and here is the clarity single details and you guys can just read it here on the top of the cap his kind of details is there and even it can capture the sunshine on the leaves of the coconut tree you guys can see sunlight was just falling on the leaves of coconut tree and details level is really really great and I was uh, far up uh, very much far up that tree and another photo to take dynamic range and which was perfectly alright and another photo which is HDR plus and against the sunlight and you guys can see the detail level which is perfect another one and you guys can see it can just perfectly the photo is here the next level details is available in that picture you guys can see on your eyes and night side photos are also great you guys can check that out according to uh, your preferences and this is another one I just checked it uh, for focus focusing issue but there is no issue with that it can focus easily that was great so there's the video hope you guys understand and if you if I miss anything just let me know in the comment section below so thank you for watching